Joe knows he uh, lost one there. But uh, those things come and go in the course of a game. Third down at six. Stadium starting to rumble. Lord from the gun. Throws. It's intercepted. Picked off by Richard Gardner down the sideline. Touchdown. Richard Gardner for the score. Well, Jamal Lord is starting to get shook a little. He's trying to hit the receiver out here, but the man that's going to intercept it is right here. Gardner sits on the outside. He sees it coming the whole way. See him? He sees the ball coming. He's going to pick it off and go the other way. Poor Nelson never got a hand on it. Gardner's the only one that touched it, and nobody touched him. Poor throw. The ball was behind the receiver. Teams, one player from each team has been ejected. Well, unsportsmanlike conduct both ways, and each team has lost a player. There's Gardner, the man of the hour. First turnover by either team, and it's a huge, huge turnover for Nebraska. When you take when you take a quarterback out of his comfort zone, whether it's on the road in front of a, over 100,000 people, he started his first three games at home, right. very comfortable, had ran the ball very well, didn't have to throw much. When you get behind on the road and you got to throw and that's not your strength, bad things are going to happen. A Penn State extra point is upcoming. Gardner, a guy that took over the spot of Bruce Branch, who was a starter there last year, has his first big interception as a Nittany Lion. It's good for a touchdown. And now it's Robbie Gould for the point after. The eyes tell it all of the Nebraska quarterback. Trying to tack on point number 26, and it is good. Five minutes, 51 seconds remaining, third quarter. Still a lot of football left, but Penn State comes out of the third quarter. Their defense puts up seven. They lead 26 to seven.